Completing the square. In an expression of the form x squared plus bx or x squared minus bx, add the constant term b over 2 squared to complete the square. For example, okay, we have here, let's make an example. Mm -hmm. Okay, number 1. If we have x squared plus... 14x and then we have blank so this form is it could be x squared plus bx or x squared minus bx but then this expression since the middle operation is addition then this is taken from the equation i mean from the expression x squared plus bx unsa un manato so, we have to complete the square and then we are going to write each completed square in factored form. So, for number 1, unsa gani itong diri asa completing the square? So, in an expression of the form x squared plus bx or x squared minus bx, add the constant term b over 2 to complete the square b over 2. So, hanapon sa nato si b. Si may ato b. Diba? This is x squared plus bx. So, the value of our b here is 14. Now, naglaong man dito na mag-add kuno kita ng b over 2 squared. That is a, what? A constant term. So, from here, ang ato b is 14 man. I-substitute lang nato. That's 14 over 2 squared so 14 divided by 2 that's 7 now 7 squared or 7 times 7 that is 49 so simply this is positive 49 i add lang na to x squared plus 14x plus 49 now kuha o na sab na to ang factor ani niya so this is our perfect square trinomial. Now, how do we get its factor? Hanapo na to ang roots ng first og last term. So, ang root ni x, we have our factored form. This is the perfect square trinomial. Square trinomial. So, ang factored form, ang root ng first term na to is x. The root of our last term, that's <coughs> 49. I mean the roots that 7. Okay, 7 times 7, that is 49. Now, the operation of our second term is addition or plus sign man. We simply have to copy that 1 and then square this binomial. Then, voila, that is the factor of our perfect square trinomial. Pwede rin nga ni siya or it could also be in this form. x plus 7 times x plus 7. Okay, shall we have another example? So, let's have x squared minus 5x. So, this is of the form x squared minus bx. Since ang ato middle operation is negative man or we're using the negative sign. So, first we have to create a constant which is of the form b over 2 squared. Now, the value of our b here is 5. We simply have to substitute that 1. We get 5 over 2 squared. So, 5 over 2 squared. Un sao naman na to? We have, substitute tra, 5 squared. And then, sa obo sa denominator, is square pod ni mo na. So, 5 times 5, that is 25. And 2 times 2, that is so we have the constant that we are going to add in the given um, expression is 25 over 4. So from here, from x squared minus 5x, mag add kita ng 25 over 4. So this is our perfect square trinomial. Okay.